Without good vision, a child's ability to learn about the world becomes more difficult. Amblyopia affects approximately 2-5% to of children. It is treatable, but treatment is most successful if detected early, and treatment begins when the child is young. By what age is treatment most successful and what does treatment involve? Stay tuned to learn more. Hi, I'm Dr. John Frederick, a pediatric ophthalmologist from Eye Surgeons Associates. Lazy eye is called amblyopia. It's vision loss in one or both eyes due to abnormal visual development during childhood. Kids can have amblyopia without any outward signs. It's crucial to screen for amblyopia by age three when it's easiest to treat. Loss of vision due to amblyopia can often be restored in most patients up to nine or 10 years of age. It becomes challenging to regain vision as children get older. If not treated, permanent visual loss, poor depth perception, progressive strabismus, and double vision may result. Lazy eye treatment is typically done by patching the stronger eye for several hours a day. It can be done with or without blurring eye drops, and patching is usually done with glasses. The treatments work together by limiting use of the stronger eye and forcing children to use and strengthen their weaker eye. An eye patch should be comfortable, yet remain firmly in place with no ability to peek around its edges. A variety of sizes and types of eye patches are available, including decorated fun patches. To wear the patch, simply attach it to the skin around your child's eye. A new treatment option uses digital therapy for kids age four to seven. With this FDA approved therapy, Kids watch TV shows using a virtual reality headset. It takes only one hour a day, six days a week, a big advantage over patching. With the VR headset, the software modifies images into treatment by rebalancing input to the brain. The therapy encourages using the weaker eye while prodding patients' brains to combine the input to both eyes. The concept is similar to patching, just delivered in a fun new way kids do enjoy. Digital therapy, however, is not widely covered by insurance. In some cases, surgery will be recommended to correct certain eye problems that cause amblyopia. It is possible to prevent vision loss from amblyopia, but treatment only works if your child uses the weaker eye alone to see. Compliance, whatever therapy is chosen, is a must for them to have a better chance of a good outcome. Your first step is scheduling an eye exam with a pediatric ophthalmologist like me. The American Academy of Ophthalmology recommends newborns receive an eye screening with a second screening by age one. Kids don't need to be able to talk to have an eye exam or screening. By age three, kids should have a screening for lazy eye and other eye diseases. When your child can identify letters, we can use an eye chart to check vision sharpness. Early identification of vision problems followed by early treatment is the best thing you can do to protect your child's vision. Schedule that eye exam today.